Okay, here's my fishing lures unpackaged. So, you got the Magnum Lizard with uh, red and teal flakes in it. And it has purple um, arms and tail and a black body. It looks blue in my camera, but that's purple, the legs and tail. I don't know why that looks blue <laughs> on my camera. Anyways, and then here's the worm, and it has teal flakes in it, and it's red, and it also has like some, like, brown, dark brown or black specks in it too. I can't really tell. Yeah, they look more like black. And the tail is like a pinkish color. Even though it says it's red, it looks more pink to me. So, yeah. I don't know if you can tell the difference. It looks more red on the camera than in real life. It looks more like a hot pink than red. But anyways, doesn't really matter that much. Alright, then I got the tungsten weights. You can see them. They're not dark colored or anything. They're just regular tungsten. <laughs> they almost look like tungsten bullets. But, yeah, that's what I call bullet weights. And then these have, like, orange snout or mouth or whatever you want to call it on the fish. Black back and, like, a natural color fish on it. has a whole bunch of little small beads in it and that's the lipless crankbait oh yeah and it has like a yellow eye then this one is the crankbait just a regular crankbait with the bill on the front oh no do not get stuck to my bed right. and again it has the same pattern colored with the bill same yellow eye too. This one sounds like it might be a one knocker, but anyways. Oh yeah, and then it has a black dot on the center where its gill would be. Same with the other one too, I didn't point it out though. And then this one has a brown top and then the red and black craw design on it with the the logo on the bottom. And it has a red eye too. This one sounds like it might be a one knocker too. Alright. And then these are my chatter baits. So this one is like a greenish swampish looking color. Like what you would expect to see in the swamps in the dirty south in Florida. Yeah, that looks just the same color. I'm probably going to have good luck down here in Florida fishing with this because it looks so natural. And then it has the swampish colors on its skirt too. It's like black with that same green and then a tannish yellowish color like the water would look. It's very, very, very realistic and has the black blade so that it doesn't scare the fish off of it. And even the hook is uh, the same color. They painted it up to the hook. They painted a pattern onto the hook too. It's really hard to tell because uh, the hook was dark that they painted, but you can't even tell that the hook's been painted on the camera. But even like the hook, hook right here, you can see the paint on that. That's really sharp. I wonder what those sharp things are for. I don't know what that's like. Super, super sharp. And it's painted. You, you really can't tell that the hook's been painted. It looks like it hasn't been. But it has. And this one, the hook, it hasn't been painted. It's 
just like that brown color. Well, brown is grayish. It looks like it might be a grayish brown color. But yeah, this one has been painted on it. There's a design painted. Oh, look, there you go. You can see the design paint right there. But on this hook, they didn't paint it. No, they didn't paint a design on this one, but who cares? I think that that's cool that they painted the hook on the other one. I don't think I've ever gotten a bait with them painting the hook on it. And this one is black and blue, and even the uh, fish eye is, well, not the fish eye, but the fish head is black and blue, and the fish eye is like a silver color. like a clear but cloudy clear silver silverish looking thing and all the way up to the hook is painted on this one too black and blue and then it has this uh skirt guard on the back here like that and this one has the same thing skirt guard Oh, yeah, and this one has the same colored eye, too, as the other one. And they both have the black blades. But again, this one's black and blue. Alright, let's see. Oh, yeah, one last thing, I don't know if I mentioned. These are the lures from Academy Sports, from Academy Sports uh, Fishing Challenge. See you.